I never grew up, I'm still a kid. I play video games, especially Mario. I have lots of dogs. <laughs> I haven't really grown up, I don't think. I'm in a different world, and it's all about survival in Mario, right? <laughs> gotta get to the end. Sometimes it feels like Mario at work, just gotta get to the end. Don't die, don't die. <laughs> I feel like on the Titanic, those musicians playing right to the end, that's what I feel like right now. I feel like we're on the Titanic and we're all enjoying that music, but right away we're gonna go under. I have been nursing for 28 years. I'm a charge nurse in Emerge, so I get report on at least 40 patients, sometimes up to 80 just on the main stretcher beds and in our OBS units, depending on how many of them are open. Pretty much every shift is chaos. There's sometimes admissions for 100 hours in emergency. Admitted patients in emergency for 100 hours. Like we don't have an infinite number of beds to put people in. You can carry it for a while, but eventually it breaks. The levee breaks, the water comes in, we're drowning. I remember that day till about noon, and then I don't have any recall. I think when I, when I got home, I think I can remember pretty much after, not, I don't remember driving home, <laughs> but uh, I think I, I came to when I got home and kind of just relaxed enough to go, holy gosh, what was that? <laughs> My head is broken and it broke that day. <laughs> I feel okay though, like I, I mean, I still have memories. I, I, maybe it was just the amount of stress that occurred at the same time. But, I mean, everybody said what a good job I did. So I must have did something, right? It seems like um, pretty much weekly now there's another announcement up saying that so-and-so is leaving. I look around some shifts and go, where did everybody go? I think it's necessary for the nurses to leave. I think that, you know, the the stress of what we do, it it just becomes overwhelming sometimes. And I don't mean the stress of saving lives and I don't mean the stress of normal nursing. I mean the stress of not having the tools to do our jobs, the stress of not having enough staff to even properly run the department and looking around and going like I'm the only one here I, I feel unsafe like are these people getting the care that they deserve it's not always about quantity right it's about quality if I every day don't have 25 nurses then we're going to have to close hospital beds within our department which means the patients in the waiting room wait longer the consequences of that people leave they get sick at home and die. If we keep losing staff and the people that are replacing us aren't trained in the same way, I feel sorry for all of Manitoba, <laughs> right? We need to figure out how to get nurses back here. 